You're welcome back on today's message. Pastor Chris says, only talking Christians win in life. Don't mistake this for being lacocious. I'm referring to being a word talker. Amen. When you're alone, don't be quiet. Keep speaking the word. Keep saying, Amen. I'm a victor Hallelujah. everywhere. I Amen. walk in the light of God. Success is in my spirit. You can't talk like this and be defeated in life. Amen. 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 So we need to be very careful on the words that we voice. Amen. Mm. Because word is life. Pastor Chris says it doesn't matter that you were born sick or poor. You can talk yourself into health, wealth, and abundance. The power is in your mouth. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. I like that. Pastor Chris says it doesn't matter that you were born sick or poor. So the kind of condition that you are in right now, yes. you know, there's a solution to it. You can talk yourself into health, wealth, abundance. You can talk yourself into anything you desire to be. You know, keep talking it. Don't stop talking it. The power is in your mouth. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Proverbs 18, 21 says, Death and life are in the power of the tongue, and they that love it shall eat the fruit thereof. Amen. Hallelujah. So the power of death, the power of life is in your tongue. So if you speak life, you shall eat the fruit thereof. Amen. Amen. And everything around you shall be alive. Amen. Hallelujah. Pastor Chris continues and he says, there is a divine ability in you to create the kind of life or environment you desire. Pastor Chris says, you can alter the circumstances of life to conform to the image you conceive in your spirit by speaking in faith in line with God's word. This is the key to living in victory continually. Pastor Chris says, start speaking and calling forth today what you want to see in your life and the Holy Spirit will incubate your words and make them a reality. Amen. Start speaking and calling forth today what you want to see in your life. Yes. Start speaking and calling forth today anything that you want to see in your life. Mm -hmm. And Pastor Chris gives us a deep revelation there saying, the Holy Spirit is the one who will incubate your words and make them a reality. Mm -hmm. It's good to know that as we speak, as we voice out the word of God, those words don't just vanish. The Holy Spirit is the one who takes the word and incubates them till they become a reality. Viewers, we're going to take the confession together and I'd like you to repeat after me. I declare in the name of Jesus. I declare in the name of Jesus. That lines are falling unto me. That the lines are falling unto me. In pleasant places. In pleasant places. I'm experiencing. I'm experiencing. Fruitfulness. Fruitfulness. Peace. Peace. Prosperity. Prosperity. And productivity. And productivity. In every area. In every area. Of my life. Of my life. For you've perfected. For you've perfected. All that concerns me. All that concerns me. In line with your will. In line with your will. And destiny. And destiny. For my life. For my life. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. We are going to take a short break right now and we'll be back to share with you today's further study of the same message. Stay tuned. Get built up this month as you join us on your favorite devotional program. Reaching you from Kenya. This is Kenya, Africa's most popular safari destination. And Tanzania. Reaching you from Tanzania, the haven of peace in East Africa. All in East Africa, we bring you life-changing truths from the world's number one daily devotional, Rhapsody of realities. Right now we have received mm. the fullness of Christ. It's up to us to rise up and preach this gospel to our mm. world. For all those who are in Christ Jesus, the law of life is at work in you. Take in that word. Believe what the word of God says. Stay tuned. A journey into the miraculous. Inspiring stories of healings and touch from heaven. Men and women who dared to put their faith to work. Chronicled in a book, the third in a miracle and faith series.
Healing from Heaven, Volume 3, by best-selling author, Pastor Chris Oyakilome, Ph.D. I have in my hand here, Healing from Heaven, Volume 3. You read it, and you can't stop. And your eyes will be full of tears, tears of joy for the love of God. Oh, I've been waiting for this book to come out because I really wanted to get it into your hands so you can see and experience the work of God, the work of his love. This is a book in which we have documented extraordinary testimonies of God's love in healing. It's our Healing from Heaven, Book, Volume 3. Healing from Heaven, Volume 3 will stir your faith and get you ready for your own miracle. Healing from Heaven, Volume 3. Please call now to place your orders or send an email. Between a child's dream and a man's reality is a teen's choice. Choice to hold on to the aspirations of yesterday, the bliss of the future, and not conform to the doubts of today. Choice to be free, to be you, to be no one else. The Rhapsody of Reality's TiVo is a devotional full of God's wisdom designed to help teenagers make the best choices and unleash their potentials. Don't be a clone. Be the best of you. Get the Rhapsody of Reality's TiVo today. Call now to place your order or order online. Welcome back to today's further studies. First Timothy chapter 4 verse 15 and Psalms chapter 1 verse 1 to 3. The first year Bible reading plan, we have Mark chapter 6 from verse 1 to 29 and Leviticus chapter 24. Amen. And if you're taking two-year Bible reading plan, then you shall read Matthew chapter 17 verse 1 through to 13 and Exodus chapter 4. Dear viewers, it has been a great delight reaching you from this part of the world, Kenya, with the Word of God in the Rhapsody of Realities. Pastor Chris has taught us today how to be a talking Christian and the importance in doing so, letting us know that there is divine ability in us to create the kind of environment that we desire. Amen. Now we look forward to being with you again tomorrow at the same time. And on that note, we say to you, keep, keep reading your Rhapsody of Realities. God bless you. Happy.